Hey everyone, I just wanted to share this journal with y'all that I made. <clears throat> it was made for someone. Um, it will be for our guest speaker at our church, at Fairdale Baptist Church. And um, I was told that she loved cheetah and red and they asked me to make one of my journals for her. So I'm going to be donating this to her as a gift. So I hope you enjoy. The cover is made out of fabric. I put some gold corners on it. I used my crocodile to put some eyelets in it to where to have a lace closure. I sewed all the way around it and then it, you know I stitched in the pages. I'm trying, I'm trying to stay in frame is why I keep moving it. All right and I hope everybody is seeing it. This right here I left a note for her to let her know this is to go underneath the pages where she can write where if something's bumpy in the back so it's a piece of chipboard so I now left her a note to tell her what that was and then I've gotten a new stamp from Stampin' Up that's I think it's retire it's retiring I know but I think it's already sold out that leaves you can stamp the stitch marks but I just gave her some goodies to write on made the pocket added some bling everybody loves bling and i don't remember the digital kit who i got this from the this one was um given to me this page but i stamped the stitching right there this is actually some coffee dyeing that i did or no this one yes it's coffee dyeing but i also inked inked on it and i don't Let's see yeah you can see it and then I did these pockets and I made her some tags to write and I did the stamping on it with them that looks like stitches and another tag they're long tags they go in these pockets another tag And another tag I'm not gonna they all come out but and I stamped around on to make it look like I stitched around and stamped some of my stamping up stamps and sentiments some more little tuck spots so she can put her you know favorite scripture whatever she wants to do in it I mean you can use this for whatever stapled some lace on there it's chalked full. I added these little heart doilies and then some stamping around there. This folds down and she can put something here. These are little tags I stuck in there. She can glue scriptures to them, write on them, whatever. And then I made these ruffles. I learned, I was so tickled. I learned how to use this. Uh, I bought a ruffling foot for my sewing machine and I learned how to use it. So I stitched some of that on. Well, I stitched, I ruffled it and then I glued it on with uh, fabric glue. And these aren't, these are uh, digital printouts I printed. I didn't actually coffee dye these. I'll call out the ones I did do coffee dyeing on. This one I did coffee dyeing on and I stamped the stitch stamp on it. I Let's see. Yes, because I glued it to the back of this page. So I did coffee dye that one. This one I inked. This one I printed out. Printed and printed and I inked them. I inked, you can tell some of the spots I inked. This one I coffee dyed. And I inked it up too, and I stamped the stitched stamp on. So it's it's very. I didn't stamp any stitching on this one. I should have, but I didn't. It's got some buttons and stitching. A little pretty right here. 
another heart doily and I did another ruffle and added some bling. I heard she likes leopard print. And I, well, I didn't only hear, I listened to a video this morning of her welcoming everybody to our women's conference on January 29th at Fairdale Baptist Church, 10 to 3. Um, and she had said in that video that she loves leopard prints. So, and here's some music paper. I coffee dyed this. The pan that I set it on, I think, made it do that. So, that was pretty cool. And then these are what they call belly bands with some large tags that tuck away underneath there. And it says, seek. And this one says, listen. And some more little tuck away spots. I love the textures and the feels. I stamped that stitching on there. I coffee dyed that. Some more little pretties and kindness and some more little tags that come out that she can write on and glue scripture to whatever she wants to do. And I glued this page in to add some more pages to it and this flips over like that this, this so this page right here you can tell it does if it doesn't have any stitching in the center it's because I glued this one in which it won't go anywhere it's glued into a another piece of you'll see well I don't guess you'll see it's a little sheet of thing I had to sewed in to where I could add extra pages. Another ruffle. More stitching. So she has a lot of writing space in there. Love those ruffles. More coffee dyed I did. And a beautiful tag. And of course, another tag in my business card. Let her know where it came from, who made it. I also always stamp handmade by Catherine Stewart. Well, I just started doing that since I got my stamp. And then here is another pocket and some more little goodies inside. All right, guys, I hope y'all have enjoyed this pretty journal. I'm sewed and put together and thank y'all for tuning in